okay. suit. Yeah, so but now that's okay. a separate stream, technically. <laughs> yeah. Good thing we did OBS. We <laughs> and it's back to saying call from the deep epilogue. Uh, we. <laughs> How? How? <laughs> we changed that. How and why? Uh. <laughs> So now the stream is episode three and full, three plus four part two. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! We, no, we can't. We'll fix that. <laughs> it in it now. All right. Sorry, chat. If you're still if you're still there. Um. <laughs> god damn, that's annoying. Mm -hmm. Uh, chat. If you're still there, uh, what was the last thing you heard? They said it ended on the whirl. The whirl. Yeah. The whirl. What? Which the world? Which? <laughs> I think the concept of them being introduced. Uh, oh no! It's that far back? Was it that far like back? We, it might have taken a while to detect that this was happening. Uh. Okay. What was me back? Well, sorta. Uh, Carrie wanted to tell us about thwirls. Wow, that was, was a while ago. Thing. Oh, no. Okay, Spence, you want to summarize then? What happened? Okay, yes. Yep. I'll, I'll summarize for you guys. Um, so, Thwirls are... Uh, they are psionic creatures that infest ships uh, with their... Uh, they love chewing on cables to the point where, like, they are... They, they gain energy from it and nourishment from eating uh, the energy from cables uh, and, and ship parts and whatnot. Uh, yeah, that's that's what Soraya learned. Uh, they also learned that they are inside like the walls of the ship, like they're in like the sort of cable management area of the ship. So they might have to go under, like through the through the grate up there, uh, to try and find them, try and get them out. And Sparrow just cast minor illusion to try of of some cables to try and lure them out. We also <laughs> learned that they like cables from Bobin succeeding on a nature check after uh, commenting that one of his favorite bands was Thwirl Infestation. Yeah. <laughs> that they were some sort of uh, high Terra heavy metal band that talks apparently very educationally about apparently. what to do in the event of a Thwirl Infestation. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah. Um, hopefully that was in, did, am I missing anything? I don't think I am. Uh, oh, uh, you uh, you haven't mentioned Sparrow's current plan. The that was the the last thing before someone pointed out. No, he did. I literally uh, just did. did. Yeah, the cables. Uh, the the, the, the cable. okay, big cables. cables yeah. to try to draw them out. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Right. Uh, cool. So Sparrow, you you cast minor illusion to create some cables for uh del some delectable looking cables to munch on. Mm. Mm. Uh, oh, that's okay, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Why don't you roll me a performance check? Sure. That sounds fun. Make them as tantalizing as possible. Oh. Oh, shit. Nice. Hell yeah. Ooh, ooh. What'd you get? 19 total. Very cool. Okay. I'm going to roll some checks on their end as well. Jesus. Uh, okay, cool. Uh, Sparrow, can you make me a wisdom saving throw? Oh, shit, okay. Oh, no. <laughs> you gotta try to find him. It's a saving throw. Yeah, because they're, they're preventing you from perceiving. That was less good. That was a five on the die with a total of six. Oh. Oof. Sparrow, you see your illusion of cables being... Flickering. Oh. What is that? Um, I, I, I'm going to try and grab at whatever is happening. <laughs> make an... Make a melee attack roll with disadvantage. How big are thralls, Spencer? You would know that they're, they're tiny creatures. Like about the size of a squirrel? Yes. Okay, cool. There we go. Oh, huh. no. That Switch. is a three with disadvantage. Yeah. Okay. 
uh, you, uh, you lunge forward and you don't feel uh, like you've grabbed anything. Just like upside down in this hole, like, ah, damn it! Ah, fuck, I missed it. Guys? You guys hear shot what BB yelling? A little bit. Help! Somebody missed it and needs help. Oh, he's, yell he's yelling for yeah. help. I'm, I'm gonna go help him. Okay. Yeah, same. <laughs> okay. Here we go. The wall is going. If, if, if you guys need anything, like, let me know, okay? <laughs> yeah. To to, yeah, to Bowman and I can other boy. Mm -hmm. uh, sure, yeah. Uh, I go. Is there anything I can do to help uh, Bowman? Uh, uh, Branchy is looking at you. you. How good are you at ship repairs? And, uh, not uh, my area. Electrical. Uh, I'm a scientist. Uh, I'm not really... I don't really know ships that well. Are you good with thwirl infestations? Uh, no, they're not really a thing on Nautilid ships. Yeah, they're kind of yeah. And yeah, I, I assume a lot of a lot of nautilid fluids rolling around. They're completely in there. filled with water, yeah. Yeah, I figured. Yeah. Um yeah, okay. Um I'm gonna go I'll tell you what, get to the cargo bay and bring into this room all of the spare wires that we have, and I will try to use it to repair what damage has been done when we deal with the thwirls. Yeah, sure, yeah, yeah, of course. I can do that, yeah. Okay, all right, thank you. All right, he he, uh, he runs off. <laughs> Meanwhile, Sewer's just helping Sparrow, if, who's still yep. hanging upside down, I'm assuming. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh my God, Chase, that picture's so cute. Oh my God. That's a thwirl. <laughs> oh my God, I love them. They're great. You don't see them yet. <laughs> you don't see they them don't yet. don't know what they look like. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right. Yeah. But yeah, no, we're trying oh. to help Sparrow. <laughs> okay. Yeah, come in and help. Oh, hi, Volvi. Hello. Up Upsie daisy, cat boy. Uh, appreciate it. Uh, I, I, I made some bait for it, and I think they went for it, but I, I, I couldn't break through their illusion. I couldn't see them. They got away. Mm. Yeah, they're really good at not wanting to be seen. Okay, um, I have two thoughts. One, we can try to get him again, see how it goes. Uh, hopefully it works. Um, if we can't get him though, we could just repair the ship enough that we can make the jump to the mall and then hire some form of extermination services on the mall for this if we just can't seem to find him. Mm. Because it's one option. Yeah. Uh, I assume they have the world services on more stations. Makes sense. Uh, uh, you guys, you guys can't make a jump. By the way, it was yeah, it was, yeah. was saying, yeah, you're repair, saying to like, like ignore the station, oh, yeah, the yeah. Ship, repair then it enough. jump, yeah. and then have the mod deal with it. Sure. Yeah, was another mm. option if we can't find him and deal with it now. I would be kind of concerned if they started chewing through more cables mid jump, and we ended up who knows where. Also, we're. Between Ma stations, uh, we we don't know how long we need to hold out to get to the next one. I mean, if we can get it fixed enough, a jump's only going to take about a second or so. It's true. You I mean, guys but... actually can't make another jump today. Oh, fair. fair, fair, fair. Oh, yeah, no. Because we tried and, it, and this one oh, failed. okay. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's fair. Okay. So, so yeah, might as well deal with them now, get... even if yeah. we want to. Yeah, you can't even attempt one until fucking tomorrow, right? There yep, it has to be 24 hours before you can make another jump. They could fuck up this ship in that amount of time. Oh my yeah, god, we really we gotta need, find them. We gotta find them. Okay, well, seems like we're kind of stuck here until we can try to jump again, so I really think we gotta find them. Yep. Yep. Mm. Um... How smart are thwirls? Like, are they likely to fall for the same trick twice? Would I know? They're not very smart. They're cunning, but not, like, brain smart, really. Okay. Hmm. They probably fall for the same trick twice. We just got to find them. Mm-hmm. I'm, I'm trying... Make another illusion then, or? 
I'm gonna keep trying to reach out with the flow to see if I can sense it. Okay, wait, wait, I got another idea. Okay, here's my plan. It's a really stupid plan, but I think it'll work. Oh, Those no. are the best ones. Um, all right, I'm gonna get in there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go in, and when I go in there, put an illusion of wires coming out of me, and when I feel something bite me, I'll slap it. <laughs> well, when you're kind of a little bit too big to go in there. No, I'm not. I can get in there. I mean, I could go in there. Fold up a little. It's fine. I mean, if you want to do it, that's fine, too. Yeah, I, I can go in there. Okay. Yeah, All right, so cast big. the illusion I, of I wires on Soraya, and then when they bite her, then she slaps him. I don't want to, like, steal your plan, though. If you, like, really, really want to try to go in there, then, like, you could go ahead. Oh, no, you get the throw slapping. You get in there. Okay. Slap you a throw. Okay. Become the throw girl. The throw girl. <laughs> I mean, no, I'm trying to get in there. <laughs> <laughs> Done arguing over who gets to get bitten by Thoros. It's fair. It's probably a good I mean, call. I, I, I wasn't joining in on that one. <laughs> okay. I'm right. going in. Okay. All right. You hop in. Uh, it's a it's a bit of a tight fit, but you're 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 okay. Ain't no, it's a tight fit for me. Ain't no way Boba could have gotten in here. Ain't no fucking he way. He said I could. Yeah, he can. He can. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. shit. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. It's just not a, you know, uh, a comfortable fit. He can do it, though. Shit, okay. Yeah. All right, all right. All right. So. Um, okay. I'm in, I think. Okay, you, uh, you ready? Mm-hmm. All right. I Wave my hands and <laughs> cast some 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 eldritch energy your way and make it look like you're just covered in loops of cable. <laughs> <laughs> trying to be as still as possible, but okay. also trying to sense them if I can. I probably can, but I want to keep trying. Mm -hmm. Uh, Sparrow, roll me a performance check again. Sure. Oh, yeah! Oh, let's go! Oh, uh, this is my oh. best work. <laughs> it's very convincing. Um, okay. Soraya, mm. I need you to make me a wisdom saving throw. I want you to do it with advantage, though. Ooh, oh. that's good, because mm -hmm. I got a negative modifier to that shit, baby. Hey, save <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> It's a 13. <laughs> okay. You, uh, you see the illusion flicker ever so slightly. Uh, we'll try to bamp it. Uh, roll me an attack roll. Uh, roll me a grapple check, actually. I assume you're not trying to hit it, right? I don't know, because Bobin's plan was to, was to whack it. I mean, yeah, Bobin, Bobin would yeah. have been trying to to get rid of the thwirls, and there's yeah. probably more than one. Okay, what's the what's Soraya doing then? Is she is she whacking it then? I think I'm whacking it. All right, so yeah, what you're gonna do? I want you to make an unarmed strike on it, uh, or unless you're using a weapon. No, I'll do unarmed strike. Okay, it's probably not a good idea to fucking activate my laser axe in here. So <laughs> I don't think I have a. Yeah, oh, no, yeah, there is an unarmed strike in your inventory that you can oh. do. Oh, you're yeah, right, nice. it's there. Nice. Nice. Hit him with it. Bullet. Hit him with it. Hit him with it. Huh. 23, nice. baby. Oh, sorry. I, meant to do, I meant to tell you to roll with disadvantage, so just roll it yeah. again. Oh, no, you slut. Okay. No. You can't see it, so. <laughs> Boo. That looked like it was going to be a net 20. Yeah. I know. I know. Mm -hmm. I was like, come on, bitch. A 14. Uh, okay. You, <laughs> you feel an impact. <laughs> <laughs> As, uh, you hit it and you, <laughs> you feel a, you hear an impact against the wall. <laughs> <laughs> 
hear its tiny thoral spinal column go. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, you uh, coming out of its illusion, you would see this. So cute! Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't want to kill it. I didn't force but you to. We must. I know you <laughs> didn't. I know. Gave you so many ways out. I know. I was just going with the plan. I did as I was told. Yeah. You oh no! Yourself it's from cute. This. Bobin was gonna do it. And you're like, no, oh, no, no. I'll kill the tiny innocent oh, baby animal. Not only. Not only did Bobin first offer, but then Spencer's. Do you want to kill it or just grab it? I know. I know. It had two hit points. <laughs> oh. oh, you oh. crumpled it. <laughs> oh, I got one. Your damage. You do five points of damage every time you unarm strike <laughs> something. <laughs> oh, my God. So you did enough to outright kill it. Um, <laughs> oh. Obliterated. Good work, Hempel. I didn't... <laughs> I didn't force you to do it, Carrie. <laughs> I, <know. laughs> I didn't want so you did that... to do it, but you're doing it. So oh, no. that's did that break the illusion, or does yeah, Soraya still look like it's a cable reset. in case there are others? Oh, you know, my just... illusion! I thought you meant the Thoral's illusion. I mean, no. I'm yeah, still I concentrating meant... on it. Yeah, uh, yeah, but she probably would have just had to like pass through the illusion, like with the sudden movement. Um, so they're going to roll a check, uh, see if they realize it is some sort of illusion. Okay, cool. Uh, I'm going to also check a thing. Cool. Yeah, there's like a, what is it? Minor illusion. Yeah, they have to beat your uh they have to beat your spell save DC to uh Yeah. With an even. investigation check. Yeah. So yeah. So, uh Soraya. What you doing? <laughs> you got one. Yep. I'm I'm sticking with the plan. I'm staying. Only still dozens as I can. more. I know. <laughs> I'm sticking with the plan. I'm seeing if I can sense okay. more, and if I can, I'm gonna babble. Roll me another uh, wisdom save with advantage. Oh, I, I hate this. <laughs> <laughs> I know you do. You I'm, so I'm, many outs. Yeah. I know I did. I'm. I'm gonna be honest. I'm surprised you didn't oh, take oh, fine. That's a nat twenty on the die, but you know, I got a negative modifier, so nineteen. Uh, I, um, what's up? I just wanted to say, I'm surprised you didn't take the out of now that you can actually see them. Soraya being like, oh, wait a minute. I don't I know. know about this. I know. <laughs> the outs Guys, just keep coming. They are. They're really cute. I got one and I can see them. And now I, I feel weird about it. Uh, With that check, with that saving throw. uh, You see, like rounding a corner. Uh, You see a live uh, thwirl. Okay, I got a I got a new tactic. Okay. <laughs> it's not gonna go well. Oh no. Hi little friend. Um, could you do me a favor and maybe not eat all of the mechanic stuff on our ship? We really wanna get to a mall. And if we can get there, we'll find you lots of other delicious things to eat. What are you doing? Kill it It I'm tilts its head at you. <laughs> I don't know if it's working. Are you trying I to do, communicate with it? You do look like a delicious <laughs> yeah. snack to it. Throw that oh, animal yeah. handling check. Roll an animal handling check. Oh, it's also a negative modifier. Mm -hmm. Okay. It sure is. Yup. Twelve? Okay. Whoa. Okay. 
it runs. Okay, that tactic didn't work. It's running. Oh, I'm gonna try to bap it. I wanted, I wanted non-lethally bap it because I feel bad now. (laughs) (laughs) Uh, you you spotted it. It was like kind of at the end of a corridor. Uh, Mm -hmm. so you'd have to run after it. I'm gonna try, I guess. Okay. Uh, let's see. What is this thing's speed? What's your speed? What is my speed? Thirty feet. It's faster than you. <laughs> of course it fucking is. <laughs> oh, crap. Uh, it is Wait. running past you. Yeah, what's up? New plan. Can okay. I can I telekinetic movement it? Can I grab it? Does it have to be a willing creature or can you do it with a uh, unwilling? Think... Oh, it's a willing creature. Yep. Damn it! Okay. This can't be an object for the sake of me grabbing it. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> Just trying to objectify this thwirl. Well, yeah, I'm objectifying up. it. Look how hot it is. <laughs> My wow. Um, <laughs> okay. Wait. Uh, yeah, no, it is running. You are not faster than it. You can't use your telekinetic movement on it because uh, it has to be a willing creature, I assume. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so. Well. Dang it. Okay, guys, I tried to reason with one and it ran away. You could action surge and dash. Oh, I could. You're right. Yeah. I'm going to do that. You're going to do that? Okay. Yeah. Uh, With that extra boost of speed, uh, you are able to... You are able to get within range of it. What would you like to do while within range? Non-lethally bap it. I want to knock it out. (laughs) Okay. (laughs) Roll, Roll an attack roll. With your unarmed strike. Oh, I'm so sad. <laughs> <laughs> what does the world come to, Carrie? I know it's a 13, baby. A 13 just hits. <laughs> cool. <laughs> you fucking. <laughs> how do you non lethally uh, uh, knock it out? Because I'm very aware of how strong I am. I want to just like flick my finger at its head. Just. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yes! It all explodes. <laughs> like put it in my belt. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! <laughs> it's safe. It's okay. It's in a little pouch or something. I don't know. That's funny. Um, yeah. it shoots through metal and you put it in a little pouch. <laughs> yeah, it'll be fine. Oh, it's no. knocked out. <laughs> God, uh, how many more of these things are there? Yep. <laughs> do you do you wander around? Are you looking yeah. for more? Okay. Yeah. We'll say you take the next maybe ten minutes, like thoroughly searching through this. There aren't any more. There were just A two. The world invitation. <gasps> okay. One is dead. <laughs> I, yep. On my would've. way back, I would I would have picked up the dead one. Also. Listen, it's for the best <laughs> that there's only one. If there were two, there were about to be two hundred. Yup. 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 It's good that you took I care of back. this now. <laughs> mm-hmm. Come back. They, and I'm like they, they up. need they need a second one to reproduce, right? This isn't some tribble situation. <laughs> oh. They do need two. Yes. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay. Okay. I think there was only the two. This is the one that I accidentally killed. Sorta. <laughs> All right, I and found some wires. Is, this, this one's this one's still alive, so we should probably like put it in like a little cage or something. Oh, you found it! Oh, good job. Uh huh. Found them. Oh, we could just you know shoot it at the airlock and be done with it. I already feel really bad for killing this one. I'd like to have a funeral for it. <laughs> Are you fucking serious? Yes. They're a, they're a threat to our lives, the the safety of the entire crew. But they were just eating. Yeah, Pursuer. sure. Like I don't hold it against them, but you know it's survival. Sewer eyes, Sparrow. Okay, Sparrow. After the SETI talk, I don't know how much I trust your judgment on this. Mm-hmm. Really, really not sure where the cuteness factor 
overrides or doesn't override your survival instincts. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Look, there, there's a line. I, I don't yeah, want to die I, in space. But yeah, I don't know when this one's going to wake up, so we should probably take care of this. Okay. Um. All right. Cool. Um. um, 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 um uh, could we get some kind of glass container to put it in so that it doesn't chew through it? Uh, yeah. Smart. Yeah, I've got one. Uh, it runs sweet. back to the cargo bay. Uh, what do you want me to do with all these cables? Do you still want them? I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat them. I'm gonna need okay. to repair the ship with them. So okay, can I'm I give gonna... this to you then? Yep. Okay, great. He puts them on. Bobin, like, holds both of his hands out, like, yep. uh, kind of, like, forklift style to, mm -hmm. like, <laughs> lay all the wires over them. Uh, yeah, no, he puts them all in your, uh, into your arms, uh, any, any, all right, uh, I'll go grab a, a, a bowl, a glass bowl or something, yeah. Perfect. He runs off. Okay. That'll do it. I mean, it, it should have, like, a lid or something, so it can't get out. Get, get two glass bowls and tape. Okay! It also needs to breathe, though. I uh, will just, we'll just, just kind of put the tape, <laughs> put the tape like, halfway around. No. Look, they were a menace to the ship. I mean, yeah, but well, they were we just were, trying to eat. We just, we I can... get that. Like, that's nature. But it's also nature for us to do what we need to do to live. We can, we, we can take the two glass bowls, put them on top of each other, and in the where they intersect, we could uh, uh, add in straws. Yeah. And then tape and then tape the seals that way, so you get a little. The, the straws can bring in a little air. I like the yeah. way you think, pursuing. Get a little, get a little swirl orb, marumbo oh. swirl ball. Yeah. I, know, I mean, we don't want the the ball to be moving around if we're using straws. Don't don't want to risk it crushing the straws and oh, turn got, off the I'll, air supply. I'll I'll write up a blueprint. We'll get a swirl ball going in no time. But first, I gotta fix all this wiring. Uh -huh. I got balls. I've got two balls. Okay. Way to go. Thanks. Ball what do you want? Them? the swirl. I, you guys I have do. fun with that. I'm gonna be doing my thing. Okay, good luck. You need help? Oh, uh, no, I'm good, probably. I'll let you know. Okay. You can help us with this? Yeah, sure. I can help. Uh, okay. All right, what can I What can I do to help? Well, we, we, need, we need to contain them. You got it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, and then take, we do. <laughs> yeah, you, you, uh, you put the, the still living Thwirl in the... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> in the glass bowl, you I guess you connect it with the other glass bowl. Uh, yeah. Make a little bowl ball. Okay. Yeah, it'll be great. How does it and breathe? Then we cover it in vent tape. We put straws in. I got straws? I got a shit okay. made in the tools. There's a drill in there. Okay. Drill a little hole. In glass? Yeah. Can you do that? Yeah. Okay, sure. Depends on yeah, the drill. Okay. Very difficult. You know. Okay. You skilled enough. Possible. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, yeah. <laughs> the, you guys draw holes in the in the glass bowls here, uh, and he is contained. The the, the coral is contained. A question: How yeah. will we know if it's escaped? It can just turn invisible. I feel like we should probably get rid of this as soon as we get onto the maw. Or sooner than that, you know. Sparrow. Oh. Please stop yeah. trying what? to kill it. Mm, I'm not gonna make that promise. <laughs> Why do you want to kill it? Oh. It's contained. But now, I mean, yeah. Do you plan it's on letting my it job go? To, it's my job to extinguish threats to this ship and its crew. That is true. That uh. is technically my job too. So I shouldn't feel super bad about killing that one. Exactly. But I do. <laughs> <laughs> now, in fairness, if if it escapes, or if it doesn't, still be able to see one way or the other through the glass. So if it tries to trick us, you know, oh, where did I go? I mean, then we could just take the glass bowl and eject that into space. You know, play stupid gin games, win stupid prizes, um, and then just do another quick look around the ship. You know. Man, sure. 
And plus, since, like, one of them is dead, then they're, they're not going to be able to, like, reproduce. So it will only be the one. So even if it gets out again, we, we know we'd only have to look for the one. But... Uh, small mercy. Mm-hmm. Ugh. Okay. Well, um, assuming that's all handled, uh, I'm going to go back to my station. I guess I'll... Thank you for your help. Yeah, no problem. Hmm. Heads back to the engine room. Uh, Bobin, you're trying to repair some stuff? Hey, yep. All right. I need you to roll me a ship maintenance tools check. Doable. It's uh, doable. Hey, y'all. Hey, y'all. Did it do it? Let's just see. Mm. Oh, yeah. That is a 21. Okay. Not... Let's say ne over the next maybe 30 minutes, you are uh, you're, you're replacing the cables entirely. Um, but you're you're very experienced at ship work, so it could have taken a lot longer, but you are very yeah. proficient in it. Heck yeah. Heck. Got him. Yeah. Did it. Uh, and once you finally, you put the last cable in, power is restored to the ship. Huh, you did it. Oh, that's a relief. And there we go. Heck yeah. Here nice over the work. Never doubted him. Yep. Here over the comms. Uh, good work, good work, Mr. Humpgrinder. And keep that up. You got it. All right. Now I'm going to use uh, my mechanist tools to make an advanced thwirl ball. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, speaking of which, uh, a security detail should probably inform the captain of surviving thrall or thrall and what we're doing with it. That's a pretty good call. Indeed. Just doing a, the the quick, you know, EA system up to the the flight deck. Uh, Captain I feel we need to give you a quick update on the Thwirl situation. Please do. Uh, there were only two. One is dead, and the other is really cute, so Soraya wants to keep it as a pet. It's contained! For now. Shh. As long as it is contained, do what you want. Make sure it does not leave. Julian, got it. <laughs> All right. Is there anything else? Uh, no, that was the main thing. Just wanted to let you know there was still a live swirl on board. It, it seems like Bobin has fixed all the problems with the ship. I noticed. So we just, so we just need to wait to to jump again. Thank you. Yes, everyone, you have the rest of the day. Uh, we will. We will avoid jump tomorrow. Sounds like a plan. Bobin puts on like a welding mask and like lights up his welder and yeah. starts <laughs> making an advanced world containment orb. Hell yeah. <laughs> nice. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Jesus fuck. <laughs> oh. All right. Are you guys doing anything with you the the rest of your day? Um, probably Good just. Question. I got a fifteen on making the orb. <laughs> nice. That's pretty solid. <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah, you feel like it is uh, fit to function. Heck yeah. At some point, I would like to secretly talk to Bolbin. Ooh. Okay. I know. Mm. Jerry, you can do that. Good. Yes, good. <laughs> I'm probably just gonna be in the um, cargo hold. Someone's got a big area to work on the the thwirl ball. Mm -hmm. That's so right. Over at over at a little station, micing it. Okay. Um, and uh, pursuer is going to go back to the comfy couch, pull out his own data pad, and watch some westerns. Sounds great. Hold it, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, bitch. Let's go. <laughs> I imagine he's got he like a some... full, like <laughs> just me. a huge <laughs> amount of uh, of westerns to to take a look uh, to watch. <laughs> yeah, he's the he's having himself a Clint East he's having himself a Clint Eastwood marathon. 
Hell yeah. <laughs> Spencer! <laughs> <laughs> None of that. And, uh, Sparrow's probably going to be trying to uh, run some quiet investigations into the crew. Mm. Sure. Uh, we'll get back to you after uh, Soraya and Bobin have their conversation, if that's cool. Yeah. yeah. Great. Uh, Soraya and Bobin. Mm -hmm. How how private is the private conversation? Are we going to secret chat or are we staying here? Oh, what a good question. I'm really tempted oh. to go to secret chat. <laughs> I don't mm. know the nature of the chat you want uh -huh. to have. Uh-huh. It's pretty much just about some stuff that Sparrow totals, but at the same time, I don't know if that's going to deviate into other stuff. Get that. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go to Sweet Chat. Let's do it. Okay. Ooh. Yeah, fuck y'all. Yeah. Ooh. 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 Bye, bitch. Did it. Me. Me, 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 me. Hey, baby, baby, baby. Spencer disabling my movement. Bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> You don't know what we wanted to do. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I'll give it back if okay. you promise okay. not to be a fucking nuisance. I'm not gonna, Never. I'm not going to lie to you like that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like... No more movement then. <laughs> <laughs> Understandable. Oh, all right. Uh, so as you oh. kind of come into cargo hold. Uh, oh, hey, what's up? Hi. Um, do you think that we could like talk privately here? I mean, it's not what BB didn't find any listening devices. There's probably not any. So we're probably good. Can I, like, do a check? I don't know if I've ever, like, done that before, but, like... Sure. Uh, cool. you can you can check if you want. Roll perception. But? <laughs> I hope they heard the roll. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you don't find any. Okay. It seems, it seems like we're, we're alone. Okay. Um, that's crazy about the stuff that Sparrow was saying. Yeah, those are like the guys, right? Those are the guys. Yeah, those are the guys. Mm -hmm. Um, I, uh, like, I've never, like, encountered them before. I've only ever heard stories from my master about them. Yeah. I mean, they seem really bad. Like, they did a lot of mean stuff to Sparrow, and all the stories weren't very nice. So, yeah, these guys he, seem like trouble. Mm-hmm. And he, he seems like, like he, he's definitely not with them. He seems like he really, really doesn't like them. Yeah. But it seems that way. It seems that way is the point. Like, do you think he could be lying about it? Um, I doubt it. Um, maybe, but I, I, I doubt it. I want to believe him and I want to help him. But, yeah. like, this is my first mission on my own and I'm really worried I'm going to mess it up. I get that, but I, I think, I think you got this. I think... I think this is gonna go really good. Hmm. It's your first mission, but you, you're gonna do real great. I appreciate that, but I feel like I'm already not doing super good. Like, when that guy really, really hurt you, like, I, I was thinking about killing him. He made me so angry that he hurt you. Mm -hmm. I get that. I want to kill people all the time, but then we just we just don't, and it's fine. Yeah, but I like I've never killed anybody before, and my my master said to only do it when it feels like really really necessary. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, I get that. I get that. And I feel bad for killing the twirl. Yeah, I'm sorry that idea was really violent. I didn't know how else to deal with them. I mean, you volunteered to do it, and then I just wanted to help, and then I did it, so it's it's my own fault. Mm, it's okay. Mm. Well, it's gonna give her a hug. I was gonna say, I wanna hug Bobin, let's go. Yeah, we, do, we, do, we, do <laughs> hug. we hug him. Mm -hmm. mm. 
and uh, it's okay. Are you doing okay? Yeah, I'm doing fine. I heal up pretty fast. Okay, we wanted to make sure. Plus, I got to see what the world looks like today, and I didn't even know they were real until today, so that's They're pretty really, good. They're really, really cute. <laughs> they are. <laughs> I'm about it. <laughs> They're just little guys. If we keep this one for long enough, I want to make him a little mech suit. <gasps> Could you do that? Over a very long time and with a lot of resources, probably. Well, how would... Like, how would you be able to get his measurements, like, long enough? Because there's, like, you won't be able because of the illusion and stuff. I, I don't know. My brother figured it out. I could probably figure it out. Which one? The dreaded Zobin. With his <gasps> oh, no. Well, if yeah. Zobin can figure it out, you can for sure figure it out. Yeah, he's probably, he's not even <laughs> a, he's not even a mechanic. I got this. <laughs> <laughs> Super got so, this. um, you're... You're doing really good, like keeping stuff secret mm. and whatnot. Mm. I'm very proud of you. It's really hard, <laughs> it's and really I hate hard. it. I don't like it. I didn't like when I had to say my last name was Hempo. I didn't like it. Oh <sighs> yeah, it really does suck. I really don't like it. Um, I really want to say things because we got all these <laughs> new friends. I just want to say stuff, but I think they like us. <laughs> I think they do too. I think they do too. <laughs> They're gonna be my first friends after you. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. So many friends. I'm going to get so many friends. Look at you out here. Look at you making so many friends. <laughs> Ton of friends on your first mission. Good stuff. <laughs> well, I'm going to do it. <clears throat> yeah. No. Okay, so we're, we're landing on probably trusting them. Yeah, I, I think we can. They seem cool. They seem nice. Okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Give a hug. Okay, um, I guess I should probably do security stuff around the ship, like patrol or whatever, so I'll let you get back to doing what you're doing. Uh, yeah, looking around. Can anybody see us right now based on what I'm looking for? Nope. Is anybody watching? Anybody in eyesight? All right. Heck yeah. Forehead kiss. <gasps> Mwah. All right, you go get him. Okay, you get him too. All right, I'm gonna get him. Okay, bye. All right, all right. Yeah. Okay, wait. I love you. Bye. I love you. Bye. Okay, bye. All right. And we, and we can go back to the void. All righty, let's go. <laughs> let's go. Never, never met this stranger in my life. Yeah, I don't know who he is. <laughs> Welcome back. Huh? Hello. Hello. Oh. What are the you talking mech about? Suit is go. Nothing, not you. <laughs> <laughs> what do you know? <laughs> Tell me. Grab the world naked. mech suit is go. <laughs> it's totally not gonna eat the mech suit from the inside out. It's super gonna work out. <laughs> totally. This is super gonna work. Wait, you didn't make a ball, you made a mech suit? Oh, the, the mech suits are coming. We're, we're, we're making plans. He's working on it. I've, I've told him that it's probably not going to work because how's he going to get the measurements because of the illusion? But he's going to try. He's doing oh, his best. Gonna, we got it. We got it. It's <laughs> totally going to work. I mean, oh, no. I mean, <laughs> you just... <laughs> you just put the ball in the head of a mech suit. <laughs> <laughs> they got psionic abilities. They could probably move around with the thwirl brains. It's fine. Charlie. All right, I can't really see the thwirl, but let me try to get his measurements here, and let me just reach out and. I... Oh! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Did you kill right. it? Let me try again. Let me try again. I'm sure it's fine. Let me just give one more shot of this, and I just. Oh! Oh, jeez! <laughs> what oh, are you doing? Fine. I'm just messing around. It's fine. I'm not crushing it on the way to my giant orc hands. That's for sure. <laughs> oh no! Okay. No, it's fine. I'm just joking around. Hmm. All right. Uh, Sparrow, you wanted to uh, you wanted to look into the crew members. Yeah. Uh, I'll see what I can investigate about them on the down low. Okay. Uh, how are you doing this specifically? Um. Let's see. Uh, where is the captain right now? The captain? Uh, he's on yeah. the flight deck. 
Okay. I want to see if I can open the door to his room. Uh, oh, it is shit. locked. Bold. <laughs> Hacking. Hacking. Oh. Uh, you see, this Super is like bold. a this is like a like key door. What the fuck is this? This uses an analog key. Okay, fuck. Uh, it's more secure now. <laughs> Somehow, no. like, in the weirdest way of using really antiquated technology. Yeah. Do I even like, have, like, thieves tools? No, no you don't. Oh. <laughs> oh, God. Reminds me of a story the, uh, I heard the other day of carjackers who got a, oh. a standard car. And they're like, what? But it, it's not automatic? How, how do we work stick? <laughs> so I had to abandon it. <laughs> they stole a car and immediately had to leave it. That's funny. That shit works. Outdated tank. <laughs> That's wild. Hmm. Okay. So I can't do that right now. Unfortunately. Um. Yeah. And Gallinel is, I guess, still in the med bay. Uh. Yes. Okay. And. Everybody except the captain is sleeping in the same, like, communal dorm, kind of, right? Uh, everyone except for Branchia, uh, he just sleeps inside of his suit. Mm. Oh, okay. Yeah, he's just a little, he's a fish man. Uh, he's, uh -huh, uh -huh. he's like a fish inside of a suit. Yeah, hell yeah. yeah. And well, he just sleeps in there. Figured he'd come into the bedroom or something, communal sleep. He doesn't so, need like, it. Yeah, he, he can <laughs> sleep anywhere. Yeah, yeah fair. He, he sleeps anywhere he wants. Um, okay. If I go into, like, kind of, you know, the bedroom, have people uh, unloaded any of their stuff? Uh, uh, Galanel probably has. Um, Alien probably has. Uh, we'll say Bobin has, too. Mm-hmm. I don't have a lot sure. of stuff, but yeah, would have, yeah. Then, yeah, uh, pretty much everyone's unloaded their stuff into this room. Probably around when we called bunks. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Then, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll go into the dorm room, and uh, if it's empty, I'll, I'll lock the door. Sure. Uh, go, I'll put you in the bedroom here. Uh, uh, this one is a proper, like, actual, like, you know, mechanical door, so you could, okay, uh, cool. yeah, you could, you could lock it. Uh, roll uh, me a data check. Data check? All right. Since it is a communal, like, bedroom, there's no lock on it. Oh, shit. <gasps> I rolled a 28 to add a lock. <laughs> Huh. It's locked. <laughs> <laughs> it's fucking locked for sure. It's extremely locked. Yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. Um. Okay. So I guess I'm gonna look through. Hmm. I know that the descendants have a lot of cyberware, and Galanov does have that cybernetic arm, mm -hmm. so that could be. That could be something, could be a coincidence. Uh, let's let's look through his stuff. Sure, roll me investigation. All right. And I'm being, like, super careful to, like, I, like, take a picture on my data pad of, like, what his, his like, suitcase looked like before I started fucking with it so that mm -hmm. I can put everything back exactly as is. Sure, yeah. Uh, investigation. Uh, 13 total. 13? That's not, not bad. too bad. Uh, you, you look through his stuff, uh, nothing's really sticking out as, like, out of the ordinary. You do find a, 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 a picture frame as well. Um, it is a picture frame of him and another dragonborn man. They seem very happy. Gotcha. It's like a, like a family photo, wedding photo, or just, like, hard they, to tell. Uh, they don't look related, I'll tell you that. Uh, but ah. it does look like, uh, 
he is in a what appears to be like a military uniform uh whereas the the person next to him is looks like a blacksmith almost hmm uh and now uh, is there anything in the background is there anything in the background uh a smithy hmm okay interesting I'll, uh, I will put that back uh, exactly where I found it. Uh, mm -hmm. Is there anything else of note? Not really, no. Gotcha. I assume he has his data pad on him, like most people. Yep. Um, okay. Once I'm confident that that's just how I left it, um, I'll take a look at Star Whispers. Okay. So, you look through her things. Go ahead and roll me another investigation check. All right. Oh, oh, oh 24. That was really was close so walk, to baby. a one. That yeah, was so was. close. <laughs> it was so, she's dancing on it. Uh, you don't find anything out of the new or out of the ordinary. Um, you don't find any like pictures. It's just clothes, basically. Mm, pretty much just clothing. Okay. Yep. Mm. Uh, roll, a, roll a wisdom check. Sure. Uh, do, 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 wisdom check. 18. Wow, you were rolling like, very well. God damn. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Can't wait till we get into check. battle to see how badly it goes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm sure. Uh, so, you, you clock something. Mo vi like the vast majority of like coalition members and just military personnel in general when they are able to like pack like uh personal items they do like m uh the vast majority of like people you you know have pictures of like their family or things like that she's got nothing like that yeah it's that just is clothes this is really weird. It's so spartan. Hmm. Oh, I'll, I'll file that tidbit away, but he doesn't immediately know what to do with it. Mm hmm. Hmm. Okay. Put, put everything back. And then, uh. I think he's gonna glance at the others' bunks and like their stuff. And I wanna roll all like something for with wisdom to see like mm -hmm. does his gut say like I should trust in them? Sure. Roll a wisdom check. Do it, you fucking coward. Do it. Yeah. <gasps> Betray us. Yeah! yeah, yeah. Good. Oh, I will let you interpret find all that. Of my horrible secrets. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, yeah. He, uh, he thinks about it for a second. It's like, they seem like real nice folks. But I've revealed this stuff to people who seemed nice before. And they've taken me for a ride. I gotta be sure. Okay. Uh, yeah, I guess he'll take a look at Soraya's. Oh. Uh, <laughs> Soraya, does he find anything? I don't know. Look, let me see what's fucking in my inventory. What do I yeah. fucking have? Anything out of, the in, out of the ordinary? I'm I guess things really. that would just seem to yeah. be, you know, uh, strange. Like, I, I very much don't, like, take a lot with me. Mm-hmm. Because I like fucking travel a lot and I don't stay in one place for very long. So it's just kind of like robes. Apparently I have a small knife. So there you go. <laughs> um, yeah. And I think the rest of my stuff is on me. I have an ink bottle, apparently. Nice. I know. How retro. Boozy. And a data book, but I imagine that's Boozy. just my data pad yeah. and that's on me, right? Uh, I think data books are different. It's different? Oh, okay. Oh, oh, yeah, data books are like USB drives. Oh, yeah. okay. I got a, I got a data book. There you go. Yeah. What's on that? Yeah, do you uh, have anything stored on there? Just... Oh. Uh, 
thousands and thousands and, of terabytes of porn. I'm yeah. sure. Yes, so much porn. Yeah. Be honest if there is one. I, if there is right, anything I'm, on there. I hadn't thought of anything beforehand, and that's why I'm trying yeah. to think. Yeah. Gotcha. yeah. It does say it does say that it is locked with a secret password on it. So he can hack it know. if he wants. Yeah, that's, He'll have yeah, to roll a check he if he wants to get in there. there. Yeah. So are you trying to hack um, it hack into it before you say anything, Carrie? Yeah, he would he would hack it. Okay. Roll me a data I check. think all that would be on there is pictures. I think. Okay. Of what? Uh tell mm -hmm. us after after he rolls he can the hack, check. yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Twelve total. That's not enough, I'm afraid. Gotcha, gotcha. So, see my vast amounts of porn another day, my boy. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. Crap. I'm not getting in there today. Uh, I guess he, he puts it back. Okay. Um, yeah, if there's nothing really out of the ordinary, um, take a look at, uh, Bobin's. Sure. Is he fine? So, <laughs> let me pull up some things here super fast. Uh, you would so find bullshit. I'm so excited. So <laughs> much porn. No, okay. After Hell about, yeah! After about 15 minutes of sorting through nearly countless bags of Uncle Porky's orc flavored pork rinds, <laughs> mm -hmm, literally mm -hmm. 984 bags of Uncle Porky's Jesus. orc flavored oh pork my rinds. God, is this a bag That's of how much I put down. <laughs> and one extra shirt. <laughs> He's got a couple diet. of. Coke. <laughs> He's got a couple of uh, of ridiculously grease stained shirts, uh, so much so that you are shocked that the shirt that he's wearing is apparently his clean shirt, his good shirt, because uh, <laughs> it would defy logic with the state that it said. Oh uh, no! But in addition to that, you would find, uh, like, you'd find a wristwatch, like an analog wristwatch, like made out of like, uh, you know actual like analog clockwork stuff like it's it's meant mm -hmm. to work outside of power sources and you'd know that from being like a pilot that that's common if you lose power or what have you you can keep track of certain time areas with that yeah uh, so you have an analog wristwatch uh you'd find a flight license from the from a ma station nearby uh you'd have a flight school insignia from that ma station as well then you'd also find a partial star map, uh, a pair of aviator goggles, uh, and then more interestingly, uh, you would find a Warhorde flight insignia, as well as a Warhorde flight license. And uh, also, uh, I'm gonna add in there, because I wrote this after I figured out his inventory, uh, mm -hmm. Bobin would also have a, uh, a physical picture on him that's got pretty frayed edges. It's been, uh, it's probably a couple of years old, uh, but is of Bobin, a goblin, and a Rothian. Mm. Uh, uh, let's explain what a Rothian is real quick. Yeah, real quick. Yep. Yeah. Yep, so, yep, yep, yep. Rothians in this setting are, they are alien creatures. Uh, they are basically a hive mind of uh, creatures um, run by one alien called the Primarch. Uh, and Rothians are... Uh, they usually go around to outskirt planets uh, wherever they can and capture people. They just take them and then fly away into the into unknown parts of space, never to be seen again. They're also really monstrous, looking a lot like yep. the aliens from Alien. Yeah. Yeah. Like with Smiling in this many... picture, like a. <laughs> let me see if I can find a picture, actually. Um, yeah. Let me. They're like they're like Alien. the boogeymen of the frontier. Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> like they are. They are absolutely uh, described in human horror stories. Like they're they're told as like campfire stories to scare children. Absolutely. Uh, here we go. Red right flag, my man. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, tabaxi children, too. Oh, no. Uh, 
This is what they look like. So, yeah. Wait for it to load. <laughs> Loading. Mm -hmm. That'll be a good time. It's a high res picture, so. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> oh, fuck. Yeah. <laughs> That's a ruffian. Mm -hmm. There they are. They Look just look go. like they look like nice little guys. Look at them. Oh, yeah, that nice no. little guy. Bobin's yeah. a little bigger than the Rothian. <laughs> not by That's much. That's wild. Not not bigger by much, but a little bigger. Just a little bigger. Yep. Yeah. Oh fuck! What the hell is this? They're all like. Like posing as though they know the picture's being taken. Mm. Like they're having a fun time. Yeah. <laughs> Incredible. There yeah. might even be a. <laughs> there might even be another orc in front of them that seems to be like almost frozen in place telekinetically. <laughs> uh, what? <laughs> What the fuck is happening in this picture? <laughs> um, yeah, he's gonna like, I guess, take a picture of it with uh, his uh, his data pad. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh yeah, copy. How much do you think Sparrow would know about Rothian like nature? I feel like that's a thing that got talked about back home a fair bit, given that they're you know they hunt the frontier. Mm -hmm. And that is where Sparrow grew up. Mm -hmm. uh, so that was probably a pretty popular campfire story. Fair. Roll me a nature check. Sure. Mm. 23. Damn. That's pretty good. Rolling Hot dice. Pretty good. Rolling pretty good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, Set down wisdom. <laughs> One thing you would know, uh, one of the one of the stories that gets passed around sometimes, it's not as common. Like most stories told about Rothians are boogies, like boogeyman stories, like just like, beware the Rothian kind of thing. Yeah. One thing you would know about the Rothians is that when a Rothian like grunt is separated from the hive mind, uh they they have the ability to think for themselves but more importantly they live like 10 years otherwise they are they are like once they're part of the hive mind they are immortal uh if they leave the hive mind they have 10 years to live i'm not sure and like based on the condition of the photo what would be my best guess as to age Chase? Um, probably about, probably about like two in terms of like how long till they just fucking die. Like they, they've got so about they... two years away from the hive mind. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it, it looks like it could be coming up on 10 years, 10 years old in that photo? Possibly. Okay. The, like it's hard to tell because Bobin's not a very tidy individual. It's not like in a sure. picture frame. It's been rustling yeah. around in a bag, so it might have been aged more than uh, is obvious uh, mm -hmm. from like another sort of thing. But yeah, it's pictures in somewhat rough shape, but it's it's several years old at least. Mm -hmm. Gotcha, gotcha. That. Oh, I got questions about that. Um. Yeah, is, is is there anything else in here that I should know about, or? Um, I don't know if this is actually in my inventory. Uh, there's a thing that's labeled Potion of Solar Radiance. Is that in my inventory? I don't think so. I might have put that mm, on I your also sheet. Don't think so that's I might have cool. put that on your sheet to be like test to test stuff out. But... Yeah, I wasn't sure if I actually had it or not. Yeah. I saw it on there. You can just get rid uh, of it. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so whoop, I almost drank it. Uh, yeah, so bunch of bunch of pork rinds, uh, two sets of flight licenses and insignia, one from Warhorde, one from Maw, uh, a star system map to some sort of star system, which unless you, like, inspect it, uh, is just a map, um, and then, uh, 
probably has no his Omni tools built into his wrenchinator. Uh, so yeah, other than that, it's just like a bunch of like old, grimy shirts and clothes and what have you. Yeah, the flight licenses. Like I assume they would probably be uh, like dated. Uh, yeah. Which one is newer? Uh, the mod license is newer by uh probably about three years, I think. Gotcha. Okay. That jives with your story so far. And what's this star chart? Uh, it would probably be an old, uh, it, the item says it leads to a distant part of, a, of the galactic frontier, but it'd probably be more towards the Warhorde side of the map. Mm -hmm. Gotcha. It's like, okay, this doesn't really mean anything to me immediately. Um... Okay, yeah, he'll, uh, he'll put that stuff away, exactly as he found it. And, uh, yeah, I guess, your, is Pursuer's bag in there? Hey, sidebar, yep. I, look, I look through most of my stuff. Um, apparently, and I don't know if I have this, Spence, because it's not in my inventory, but okay. part of my background says that I have a prayer book or a prayer wheel. Uh, you don't Would have I that. Would I have that? No. I don't have that. Sick. That's not Just want to make sure. Yeah. Want to make sure. Mm -hmm. Sick. We're good. You've got a custom Pursuer. background, and I forgot to delete that. Um, That's all good. Want to make sure. Mm -hmm. My jig would have been up. <laughs> <Why am> I... <laughs> yeah. okay. Excellent. Moving on. Get Pursuer. <laughs> oh, um, yeah. Is, is Pursuer's bag in there? Yeah. Um, he would have his data pad and his repeater and probably. You know, probably some other stuff on his person, but uh, you know, when there's no need to roll to just like rifle through the bag itself, right? <laughs> nah. So you'd uh, going through it, you'd find his concussion rifle, and let's see bedroll, crowbar, flashlight, igniter, life suit. So like a like so that he can like go out into the void of space. Mm -hmm. uh, vent tape, binoculars, and comm set. Okay. And uh, <laughs> a couple sheets of uh, paper that have obviously what he would normally have on the data pad. He's just printed out and and aged old school. The the bounty wanted posters of some targets. <laughs> That's incredible. Uh, <laughs> Pursuer's cute. <laughs> right? Oh my god! Unexpectedly fanciful. <laughs> um, other than that, like, no personal effects. Just kind of, like, pretty standard kit. Yeah. Gotcha. Okay. Puts that stuff back. And uh, yeah, make sure that everyone's stuff is uh, exactly as he left it. Mm -hmm. Um, he'll remove his lock code from the door, and uh, yeah, head back out. All right. While that well, happens, what did you find in your own bag? <laughs> What's in your bag? <laughs> Drugs. Wouldn't you like to know? <laughs> uh, pursuer. What have you been doing yep. while they've been having these, you know, little excursions? He's He's been living his best life, enjoying some Clint Eastwood and Terrence Hill movies. Right. Yes, of course. Good. <laughs> uh, you would you would see that uh, Aelion is, uh, he, she would just occasionally glance over, like, over at your, your data pad. Uh, you, you ever seen these before? Uh, no. No, I haven't. I don't usually look at human stuff. Oh, it's, uh, it's, uh, good, good entertainment. It's, um, my best friend introduced them to me. Changed yeah. my life. <laughs> hmm. Interesting. <laughs> uh, she's, roll me, uh, can you roll me an insight check? Sure. Uh, just normal? Yeah. And that was a... Oh. It's a blind roll. It's automatically hidden from you. Okay. 
<laughs> I was keep like, forgetting. Keep I, forgetting. I saw, I saw this. I, I went to check on it, and all I saw was, I, I missed the Soraya thing, and I saw unarmed strike. I was like, did I hit the wrong button? I didn't mean to punch her. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> <That'd> be fucking incredible. <laughs> Uh, you see that she is trying really hard to hide it, but you can tell that uh, she is tr she is she doesn't know how to connect with people. She is interested in what you're saying, but she's kind of putting on an air of like, yeah, whatever. Like, <laughs> it's fine. It's whatever. Like, I don't care. But. She just like very subtly like moves closer to you uh to watch more clearly on the on the data pad. But it, if you didn't roll really high, uh you would have uh probably just would have missed her moving closer with how subtle mm. it was. Alright. Um well taking note of that, pursuer is going to adjust the screen so that uh they can both see it more clearly. Mm hmm. Cool. All right. Uh, she thinks she's being sneaky, by the way. <laughs> so she's just like looking at her data pad uh, every so often and then watching your watching your data pad uh, while you while she thinks that you're not looking. So she's so cute. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was a uh, old, old Terran uh, media. Was, uh, yeah, they used to call them movies, and uh, this uh, this is my favorite kind of movie, western. Was, western uh, is it from like the west part of their empire or something, of their territory? I, in, not, uh, I'm not sure. As uh, they were kind of filmed all over the place, but they, uh, they called them they called them westerns, and they all seem to take place in this mythical area known as the Wild West. And, uh... Oh. Yeah. So, everyone everyone carries a gun and has their own secret agendas. Huh. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. Because, uh... How I, how I got into uh, bounty hunting. Yeah. Mm. Learn, I learned, uh... <laughs> I learned from the best, and he sort of taps the screen. <laughs> <clears throat> That's uh interesting. Um uh, Roll me a perception check, pursuer. Okay. <laughs> uh perce there it is. Normal roll perception. Uh you you peek a uh you get a peek at what she's doing on her uh on her screen, on her data pad. She's making you in her game. <laughs> oh my god Pursu just pursuer not getting you know, like, it was like you know not really sure is that me her eyes go wide she's like <gasps> uh, no uh no it's not oh. mighty, it, mighty good likeness it's a purely coincidence Eh, don't worry. I uh, I like to I like to keep track of uh, people in my surroundings as well. It's uh, good to keep yourself on your toes. Ah, uh, I'm gonna. I've got. It's getting late. I'm gonna go. Um. You sure? We're getting to the best part. They're about to have the duel at noon. Uh, roll, roll persuasion as well. <laughs> Wait. Get her. Let's fucking go, bitch. What'd you get? Uh, persuasion rolled a nine. <sighs> no, uh, I'm uh, I'm I'm feeling really tired. Uh, maybe next time. Could uh, I? I'll hold you to that. Would I be done with my Boban conversation by now and be coming in the door if she's trying to? Sure. Leave? Yeah. Hell yeah. Hi. Where are you going? Uh, hi. Uh, uh, to bed. I don't know. Oh. Oh. Okay. Well, I don't. I don't want to. I don't want to keep you up. Great. 
But bye. Damn it. <laughs> bye. What was your plan? <laughs> Honestly, I just want to talk to Pursuer, but I was kind of hoping that she would be put off and maybe back up back into the room and uh, that I could convince her, but she had a good reason for leaving. So, yeah. <laughs> yep. Fair. Yep. Yep. Good. Couldn't argue with, I want to go to bed. <laughs> like, I'm not an <laughs> asshole. <laughs> like, just fair. Mm. She uh, goes, don't. <laughs> right? The fuck am I going to say to that? <laughs> uh, she grows off. <laughs> <laughs> sure. All right. Fuck. I go in. Say yep. She doesn't want to socialize. <laughs> She's so cute. I get her. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Here, I'll put you, I'll put you over here. Thank you. Hi, Pursuer. Hey. There's, uh, how are you doing, Soraya? You, uh, you finished, uh, with the ball? Bobin's working real hard on, on that and a little mech suit. It's gonna be great. Mech suit? What's a mech suit for? For the thrill. I'm sorry, what? He wants to make a mech suit for the the thrall. I mean, I, I told him it's going to be really hard because it's got the illusion and everything going, but he wants to do it, so like, why not let him try? I... Okay, I, I feel like giving... Giving an invisible rodent a uh, mech suit seems like a recipe for disaster, but uh... Oh, yeah, he is. I He's gonna make it, this going. He's going to make it more powerful, isn't he? Yeah, we should maybe no, stop I'll... him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, um, yeah. I, I feel like the ball is good enough for now. I don't, I don't feel like we need to give it uh, the ability to punch people. Yeah, we can talk to him about it after. Uh -huh. How you doing? I'm fine. Just uh, enjoying my movies. I'm feeling okay after being so hurt. Oh yeah, no, uh, it, uh, got fixed up real nice. I'm glad. Things seem kind of tense, like back there with with the with the guy at the cargo place. He was giving you and Sparrow like weird looks, like you know what that's all about. I have a couple of fairies. Was, uh... yeah. oh. Well, one could just be a particular uh, bigotry towards. Cybernetics and people with cybernetic parts. Oh, that's gross. Yeah, but not uncommon. Mm. Mm. I hate that. More likely, however, perhaps uh, association that Sparrow and I share a uh, mutual enemy. Oh. Her eyes are yes. wide, and she's, like, scooting close to you, wanting to hear the story. <laughs> well, when we, uh, the last time the two of us worked together, we crossed a very powerful dragon. A dragon? Norza the Sable Swindler. What a cool name. Mm-hmm. And, uh, a lot, of, a lot of political pull. Oh. Yeah. As far as I'm aware, the only being in the galaxy with a bounty on me. <laughs> you have a bounty on you? Yeah, I mean, it's not reputable. Again, it's, uh, you know, uh, criminal, you know, criminal underworld bounty, but, uh, yeah, every now and then, I'm, I'm hunting, and sometimes I'm being hunted. It's, uh, Weird world that way. A bounty hunter bounty. <laughs> Crazy, right? Mm-hmm. Well. Uh, yeah. Could be either of those. Maybe even something else I'm not thinking of, but those seem like the most likely uh, explanations. So you and Sparrow are friends from before? Friends might be a little uh, overstating the case, but uh, oh. we have been work colleagues in the past. Oh, okay. It's been some time since we worked together. It was one particular job, again, 
Fable Swindler gig. And, uh, I was back with him and his whole crew. Good people. Oh, those, those, the people he brought up earlier? Mm hmm. The ones that didn't make it. Yeah. I'm so sorry. Uh, again, I only knew him for the one mission, but, uh, Pharaoh. I don't know. I don't know what he's going through. I'd say what he's told us, obviously, but I mean, mm -hmm. yeah, can't be fun. You know, it seems like a lot. So you guys had a mission together before. I'm guessing you didn't get the guy. No, we um, the the job wasn't to get the guy, but uh, we uh. We definitely, we definitely ticked him off. Ugh. Yeah, he, we he still have, like, wanting to get you guys? Uh, the last I heard was, um, Ugh. yeah, sort of, uh, again, we're, we're a powerful figure in the underworld and, uh, a pretty dangerous enemy for us to share. I mean, maybe it makes it a little bit easier that you guys get to share it. You can have each other's backs on it. Yeah. I know my life got a little bit easier after I became friends with Vulpin. There's a nice thing about friends. Mm-hmm. I would be without Volmar. Volmar? Oh, he's doing okay. Oh, my, um, my friend from the bar. The, uh, the, uh, the star elf with the similar sense of fashion. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> First friend. <laughs> Those are very special. Anything. So he will go on missions with you too? Oh yeah. It was, uh... I mean, he's the one who introduced me to the Westerns. He's the one, he's the one that, even if he didn't intend it, <laughs> introduced me to the concept of bounty hunting. Give me uh, my new purpose. Spencer, would I know what a Western is? <laughs> no. <laughs> cool. Absolutely not. <laughs> what? What's a western? Oh my god! Oh, I love this part. Um, I'm old... about to introduce you to Taylor Swift. <laughs> That's the exact... <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking that exact show. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, got uh, it. Oh. Do you got? Sorry to cut you. Sorry yeah. to cut you off. Uh, yep. do you guys, do you just, I don't know, explain Westerns to her? Like, we yep. can just kind of... And then just, we watch them. Just, and, yeah. Yep. yeah. He, I, ex I explain what Western is, and I, I pull up My Name is Nobody with Terrence Hill for her. Cool. I watch ecstatically with him. Incredible. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. At what point am I done with the orb? Uh, say an hour would pass. Okay. That sounds fine. That's reasonable. Cool. 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 Uh cool. Uh all right. We are we are real we're close to being way over time. Uh <laughs> yeah. so I just wanna before we end, mm -hmm. I wanna bring into the room my my grand invention, the tilt of world nine thousand. <gasps> oh, <laughs> it's incredible. Big glass like sphere like a plastic -y glass kind of sphere that he's got that's crafted very much like a hamster ball an actual like durable version of our taped up version and uh it's got a little hatch you can screw off and there's bells on the inside of it so that when it rolls around it makes noise and even if you can't see the thwirl inside you can see the ball rolling around i love it big fan <laughs> incredible <laughs> my goodness 
Uh, luckily, it's still knocked out, so you can uh, just put it in. <laughs> <laughs> Whip. Whip. Oh, but that's amazing. Also, me and Persura were talking. You maybe shouldn't make a mech suit for it. Oh, fine. You probably <laughs> like, will eat the wires. Yeah, it'll get stronger, and it'll get out of, of the tilt the world 3000, and it, it's 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 going to ruin the ship some more. Yeah, I do like the tilt of world 9000. Oh, 9000. I'm sorry. I got that name it's wrong. Okay. I'm so sorry. It's okay. I, I had... Oh. Eight, I had 8,999 of those I made before it, obviously. And that's why this one's so perfect. <laughs> okay, I lied. I just made the one and I called it 9,000, but it sounds really cool. It does sound really cool. <laughs> oh. Well, yeah, what's, uh, what's the Western? And then we all watch Western. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. This happens join, four more join times. Me. Yeah, Yay! once join his crew member. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Yeah, join me. It's a big couch. It, it, Are you sure this couch is big enough for both of us? <laughs> Damn. I'm about to find out. <laughs> uh, what I'd like to end on. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, Sparrow, you were just yeah. finishing uh, going through everyone's possessions when... Oh, uh, no! When Alien, uh comes in. Hey. <laughs> Oh, hey. You thinking about turning in? Yeah, I'm thinking about it. Yeah, I think I might do likewise. Hmm. Been a long day. Yeah. Good night. Yeah, uh, good night to you too. Uh, Sparrow. Yeah? She said that in Colt Cant. And then she retreats to bed. And that's where we're going to end today's game. <laughs> She's fucking on to you, my man. You're fucked. Woo! You're going to get killed in your sleep. Oh, my God. <laughs> She's one of them. <laughs> You're a monster, Spencer. I, I, I love her totally, very much, definitely real name of Alien. It gives me the exact same uh -huh. name as human. Yes, <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, there you go. We'll see if that's her real name oh or God. not. We'll find out. We'll, we'll see. <laughs> oh, what a good fucking game! Yeah. Oh. <sighs> Uh, thank you guys so much for, uh, so much for joining us, uh, for this episode of Sweet and D, the Crypt Star Saga, and we'll, we'll catch you next time. Yeah, yeah. thanks, oh, thanks bye, you guys so much. Bye, everybody, we love you. Bye. bye. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> this has been a great game for Izzy. <laughs> Why do we have to end now, damn it? <laughs> oh no. Spencer. We need to end on cliffhangers. I just saw. I think yep, I know the thing you're talking about. <laughs> did it says check your DM? Yeah. Oh, no, it's no. great. It's so good. What is it? <laughs> what is it? Let me just uh I'll just share this on stream, assuming she's okay with it. Just gonna go back to the play screen real quick. There you go. Oh, oh my god. Yeah. It's it's fucking it's beautiful. Uh beautiful. We got him. see it. Mhm. Mm I assume hopefully it'll show up soon. <gasps> it's incredible. Oh, I, I don't see it yet. I don't see it yet. What is it? Oh, look at those big muscles. He's yeah. so strong. Oh, you can see it on stream. There he is. Oh, so happy. Oh. <laughs> Oh yes. my god, that's adorable. <laughs> Sotlot Beavy, my beloved. Mm -hmm. Good old Sotlot Beavy. Little Soraya is so cute. Uh. Oh my god. Look at him. Look at him flexing. Look at powerful him. Flexing powerful kitty muscles. Going. <laughs> His meowsles. His meowsles. Meows <laughs> I'm so yeah. tiny. Look at how tiny I am. Right? Yeah. She's just so a teeny. Uh, ah. What a good game. That was a fun, that was really fun. That was, that was great. Very fun. Oh, oh no. honey, yeah. it's playing. Uh, uh, all right, let's find somebody to, to end. End. I get the that. Fist. 
Uh, Again, his title, the art, The Fister. You're welcome. The Fister. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this is the pose I make when I fist him. <laughs> uh, let's see who's going. Uh, uh, got Sayu's Lanny, going? 47. Yep, Sayu's got a paltry 1.1 thousand. Barely, Barely oh. one. Nobody's showing up. My God. Sea Dog's got uh, peasants 6.2k. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Uh, -huh. uh Tabby Cat is streaming an art stream. Ooh. Okay. Lanny's got 47 and Aaron's doing Escape for Tarkov at 25. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Very cool. Uh doesn't say Aaron's oh, wait, live he, for he, me. He, 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 he might have just logged off it. Did the Aaron, Aaron's yeah, just Aaron disappeared. Just went away, I think. Uh, yeah. I see. Yeah. That'll do it. Okay. Uh all right. Let's send him to let's send him to Lanny. He's playing against the storm. Heck yeah. Yeah. Hell yeah. Um get him. Yeah. Let's uh Lanny Couture. So do you Aaron, do you, or, What's yeah. that message? Get him. Alright, good. All right, boys, this is Lady Batour. You know him, you love him. He plays Vegeta in Dragon Ball's The Abridged. Uh he Lots of other stuff. And lots of <laughs> lots of other stuff. Uh, 55 other characters in Dragon Ball Z Abridged. Uh -huh, uh -huh, yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh yeah, he's playing uh, against the storm. It's a good time. Uh, what were we saying? Tell, tell him Mr. Fister says hi. Yep. Yeah, that's a good one. Mr. Fister says hi. Oh my god. <laughs> that's Dr. Mr. Fister. Mr. <laughs> Dr. Dr. Mr. Fister. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, thank you guys so much for joining us today. We'll catch you next time. Uh, Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye, everybody. Thank you, Major Press. Thank you, Major Press. Thank you, Major Press, so much.